What's good, world? It's me, my sister, and my other sister. Oh, you gotta be kidding me. Okay. Anyway, we're at Sonic, and it's taking too long because this place is too dumb. Everybody was like, hey, y'all trying to go to Sonic or not? And then I was like, hey, y'all trying to go to Sonic or not? And then they was like, yeah. So then we came, and then everybody else was like, yeah, too, I guess. So everybody here. I just want a milkshake. And we went to... We first over, we first were over there on one of those thingies, and then I pressed the button like three times. Well, it was two times. I waited. I legit waited for like a good five minutes, at least five minutes. No, and no one ever answered. A few minutes, a few minutes ago, I said it probably exploded yesterday. That's why it's not working. <laughs> yes. Um, so then anyway, I came around to this one, and they answered me here. But they're not coming. But they're not. coming. Ow, Taking so my fourteen dollars. <clears throat> Don't approve. Afternoon, guys. Um, I am about to eat lunch. This is day three of my back on Weight Watchers week. <laughs> Hopefully, I'll stick to it this time. So far, I'm doing good. So I don't know. It's been three days. And I haven't messed up yet, so hopefully this keeps going. Um, but today I'm having a chicken noodle soup and a piece of toast with a slice of pepper jack cheese and a slice of cheddar cheese. And you know when you have toast or sandwich or anything, you gotta cut it diagonally because that just makes it look fancy automatically. So this isn't your regular toast. This is that fancy artesian artisan however you pronounce that word artesian sounds cooler it's that fancy artesian uh toast right there with that on uh, fancy 1000 percent uh imported peppa jack cheese and that 1 million percent imported uh cheddar cheese say word ever since i got up today i've been on my computer and I've been reading all your comments and I've been trying to download music and yeah because today is Ariel's gonna sit down and make a build a resume even though I have no idea how to do that so that's going to be task one for today figure out how to make a resume two make it three start applying for jobs so yeah First of all, I want to say thank you to everyone who has left comments on my little heart to heart video I just posted yesterday. Y'all understand, my feelings have changed so much from when I posted that video yesterday to till now. Like, I feel so much better. I mean, I'm still... I'm still really confused about what to do, but I just feel so, I don't know, I feel so much better after reading everyone's comments and advice. And I realized that I, I'm kind of being slightly ridiculous at the moment because I haven't even applied for any position anywhere yet. And I'm already like freaking out. I first should apply for jobs and then see what I'm offered, if anything. Who knows, I might not even get a job. And then I'll be really crying. But... <laughs> I realized like okay I can calm down a little bit it's not super serious just yet I mean it's pretty serious but it's not super crazy serious like for me to be like bawling my eyes out every five seconds just at the thought of it so I no longer feel the need to cry every time I think of applying for a job now so and I I I give credit for that to you guys for those of you who commented and stuff on my video and you guys made me realize that I'm really just freaking out a little bit um so thank you so much thank you so much you guys don't understand I you guys just really don't understand I was actually really surprised at how many comments the video had gotten in such a short amount of time um because usually I mean people comment on my videos but I usually don't get any more than like 20 comments so I was really surprised this morning when I got up and I had like 40, I think it was at 47 comments when I got up this morning. And so I read through all of them and 
yeah so thank you guys so much um yeah thank you the weather is boo-boo today it started thunderstorming last night like hardcore thunderstorm like the electricity went out and everything last night and yuna was freaking out shivering she was doing the palm shake on them and i was like you need to calm it down yuna bear i don't know why she was so freaked out but she was super scared and she was shivering like crazy shaking my entire bed last night i was like uh uh boo boo you got to go so then she went and hid underneath the bed which i was fine with that because i was tired of her shaking my bed <laughs> but um yeah so then today like the the um what's it called the smoke detector it started beeping like beep. so i guess the battery needs to be changed or something and she freaked out when she heard it and she started shaking like crazy hit that harlem shake again and i don't know why that scared her so much but the sound of the smoke detector beeping earlier today freaked you out and she was like shivering in fear and went underneath the bed again she you know why are you weird huh you feel better now you just had lunch your your turkey dinner happy valley <laughs> cute But today, it's, it's just started, it's been kind of raining a little bit off and on. I like rainy weather though, it's my favorite. I really love thunderstorms, especially during the daytime. I'm not a fan of them at night though, because it's a little creepy at night, because you're like, is it a thunderstorm or is there gonna be a tornado? Cause you know, I live in Tennessee, we occasionally get them there tornadoes. So I don't like, thunderstorms at night because you can't see a tornado if it's coming you just hope there's not one because <laughs> in my mind thunderstorms equals tornado thunderstorms because in my mind thunderstorms equal tornado Um, if you live in this place, I'm gonna need for you to send me some Mr. Spriggs barbecue because one, when you deal with Mr. Spriggs, you only deal with the best. Two, he sang that commercial too good. And three, barbecue tastes good. So I want to go there if I'm ever if I ever find myself in Oklahoma, Chelsea. We going to Mr. Spriggs. Matter of fact, let's make that a mission this summer. Let's go see. Let's go to Mr. Spriggs, though. Why don't be not there anymore? I know that'd be really tragic.